I met some new people uh, that I didn't know before, and we're having a great time. And we've, you know, we've gone on outings together. Uh, some of our chapters form movie clubs, uh, book clubs, uh, various kinds of ways to, to get together, uh, bridge clubs. A lot of that is happening, but it's a sense, well, why not? Why don't we do that? Why don't we build these kind of opportunities for people to, uh, to have some fun uh, and feel good about it, not only in terms of keeping the energy level up, uh, but in terms of uh, getting a little fitness. So some of our, our chapters are involved in this phenomenon of Nordic pole walking. Does anybody know what this is about? Great way to kind of do, get out, have a little exercise. But the key thing, if you're a person like me, is I'm always m more likely to get out and do something as part of a group activity in terms of exercise than to have the discipline to do it by myself. So if it's a commitment to the Nordic pole walking group, I'm in. If it was just me getting out there, I'd find ways to take a day or two off. And so that sense of being out there to do things together is, a, is an important part of, uh, of what CARP's all about and what the chapters are all about. And, and while we, we really encourage the sense of um, intergenerational, uh, I can't help but think you know, that, uh, of the line that uh, Lillian Carter, Jimmy Carter, president, former president Jimmy Carter's mother said, uh, one time, she said, sure, I'm helping older people. I'm going to be old one day myself. And she was 80 when she said that. <laughs> so that sense of eternal youth, and I've still got lots to give. It's not a matter of age. It doesn't, that doesn't stop, as you all know. There's, there's research out there uh, that uh, if you ask anybody in this room to fill out a form, how old? How old does old, when does old start? 50, 60, 70, when? The common data shows that old starts 15 years older than you are. <laughs> so you can be 80, and we've, we've all had that experience. 80 years old, and guy says, I'm out there, I got, we got, it's great to be intergenerational, but we gotta help the old people. And, and he wasn't talking about himself. Talking about the old people, 15 years hence. So, ladies and gentlemen, I think I think I'll end there. We, we've got some time, I hope, for some questions and and, uh, and thoughts. Uh, but I really am proud of the folks who've pulled together and, and Bruce and Goldie for uh, saying, "Listen, uh, uh, there's there's a great community in Chatham Kent uh, and lots of CARP members, but they they don't have a clubhouse." They don't have an organizing principle so that they can get together and say, this is a concern to me, uh, how do we get that, you know, how do we get that as an issue in our community? So that notion of being a clubhouse uh, of CARP members, I think is a key one. It implies a lot of, you know, you do good things, you have some fun doing it, and you make an important contribution to society. So those of you who are members now, we're grateful for your membership and your continued membership. Uh, those that are not yet members, I hope you'll join us. Uh, because you will find uh, that that voice of CARP gets stronger and stronger the more members we have across Canada. We have a little over 300,000 members now, and we have 55 chapters. Four years ago, we had 12 chapters. And the, the growth of the chapters is really a reflection of the number of people who want to get involved. We don't go out and necessarily say, does anybody here want to start a chapter? We get the calls coming in as often as not, where somebody said, how can I get involved? Uh, I understand there are chapters. How do I get involved in starting a chapter? So that sense of the want to be involved is very refreshing uh, because it really says that this mission is important, and uh, we see CARP as an important way uh, to have that voice. So thank you all for your time today. And congratulations again to the organizers. And um, if there are questions, David and I would be both delighted uh, to take them on.